Hi there, I'm Lisa Riley and I'm currently playing Sadie in Little Voice at Hull Truck Theatre all through the summer holidays. I did see the film um, about three years ago before, obviously, I'm from now in this, and I've seen the stage show done before, but I think Hollywood did put their stamp on it and I think they made it a bit fluffy and, and, and didn't see how raw the actual real script is, which I think in the play you do actually see, especially like with the relationship of the mother and daughter with Mary and LV, you know, that there basically really isn't a relationship there. And that is why Little Voice is as timid as she is, you know, and she doesn't, she's not allowed to have a voice when Mary's around. You see that Sadie, my character, does look after Little Voice uh, in a maternal way and she's proud and when she sings, it, it sort of moves her to tears because, you know, she, she thinks it's just, she's so wonderful and the talent. Um, and I think Sadie's a bit of a fixer. She doesn't say anything, and that, that's, how, you know, brilliant how people... You know, some people just sort of, they make things right without sort of going, oh, I've done this. That's Sadie all over. She just makes things right. Um, she sees within the family how, how dysfunctional it is, but, you know, makes your little voice is all right. I'd done so much work prior to, to, uh, to Emmerdale, but, you know, TV and theatre. And it was actually Linda Barron, funnily enough, when I was filming uh, Fat Friends, who we went out for supper one night, and she said to me, uh, she said, oh, you know, you've you got to think about doing theatre. And I was like, oh, good, I can't, you know. And I've been so locked into the whole t telly thing, whereas if you make a mistake, you can go back and do it again. And I think... Like, Linda really pushed me to, to sort of get back into theatre, and, and I'm really indebted to her for that, really. And, and sort of now I've spent the last just five and a bit years doing play after play after play and, and loving every minute of it. You know, I had a play written for me, and that, you know, and I did Naked Truth. That was just incredible. My main advice is sort of, if you really want to be involved in, in, in acting and performing, don't look upon these programmes that we have on the telly, like, you know, your, your talent search one, because... It's not about the fame. When I was nine years old and I got my place at Oldham Theatre Workshop, it's because I could do it or they saw something in me that was a little bit kooky and different, right? And it's not about the fame game. When I was 18 and the nation knew I was, that isn't the best thing about it, you know? And it's, everyone wants fame nowadays and, and that's nothing to do with what we do. we do. We do jobs because we want to play different characters and we want to become different people you know, with different scripts and different roles. And, and that's what it's all about. So my main advice would be do it because you believe in it and you love, you love performing, but don't do it because you want to be famous in the magazine because that really is rubbish. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Lovely.